So this would be pretty interesting. I believe I've seen Cat Don't Pat play before. Uh, they might have joined during the last bi-weekly. I can't really remember too much. So far we're seeing very big similarities of the uh, last game that we just saw on stream here. Fizzles taking the role of no one now playing really aggressive and trying to find those chains with just a lot of panels at his disposal. Cat Dome Pat had a really good starter though. Just gonna have to try to find these follow-ups afterward. It looks like Fizzles getting the better of this late game so far. But just like that, Fizzle, the pressure was just a little bit too much for Cat Dome Pat there. Fizzle going to be taking this early 1-0 lead right now. Oh man, he's raising it all the way up. You gotta be really careful there, because if you happen to drop your chain, your health can just tick away pretty quickly. Level 5 will bail you out just a little bit though. We haven't seen too many matches be played on level 5 throughout the tournament. You do have a lot more lenience. As you can see, you have 50 health total, so... You can afford to make mistakes here and there. I think that is equivalent to uh, almost a second, full second of health. Because I believe every uh, health value is one frame. I could be just saying stuff. I don't think I've ever like actually found out this information. It'd probably be good for me to know. Since I kind of stream this every other week and play this game quite a bit. <laughs> but yeah, uh, after Fizzle took a pretty quick game one, this has been pretty uh, even throughout the uh, stage here. It looks like Fizzle's been doing a pretty good job of keeping up that pressure, and yeah, uh, Cat Don't Pat just uh, was struggling a little bit with the clears, even if they did get them, it wasn't guaranteed that they could have found another clear to get to the garbage there, so good stuff to Fizzle. Now he's up 2-0. Yeah, he's playing super aggressive with that high stack. That's scaring me. I'm afraid he's just going to end up dying in like three seconds one of these rounds. Still with the high stack, but he's finding clear still to bail him out. He's going to go for down stacking, but that small garbage block and a little bit of panic on his cursor does not get uh, the uh, movements that he wants. And now Cat is on the board, only down 2-1 to one now. All right, let's see if he raises all the way up again. And just about, just that little sliver at the top there. Give him the smallest bit of breathing room, but he's got a really good chain set up now. Ends up dropping it, but he's gonna continue to find clears. Put some pressure back on Cat right now. Gonna lower it just a little bit here. Got a nice lag chain set up off the garbage, so this could be good for a uh, cat. Because uh, Fizzle still got that really high stack, and he's gonna eventually have to go for down stacking here. But he's got some favorable clears on the right, and that's gonna eventually lead him to surviving a little bit longer than cat. Up 3 1, only one more point to take this set. Let's see what happens. <laughs> All right, both of them with pretty modest chains here to begin with. And, oh, I kind of glanced away there for a second, but maybe I'm guessing Fizzle got caught off guard with a tall stack and didn't really get a clear immediately there. And Cat's going to take another one there. Still not out of it. Got to win two more in a row here to stay alive. Can't afford to make any mistakes. All 
Alright, there's a nice little chain there at the beginning. Oh, cat don't pat's gotta be careful. Ten health left. Manages to down stack a little bit and find the purples. That was super scary. Fizzle was a little bit scary on his screen too. Manages to avoid the danger. Not gonna have a lot of garbage on a screen to deal with, and Cat's gonna try to find it. Wow, that was actually a really nice clear there. Time the greens just right in order for them not to clear too early. And that's gonna lead to a five chain with a six combo. So this is gonna be some pretty good pressure on Fizzle now. Cat's gotta keep up the pressure though and try not to die to the damage that Fizzle sent at the beginning here. Yeah, because this garbage is still coming down right now on Cat. But looks like it got past the bulk of it. Oh, sorry guys for all the yawns. But look at that fizzle with a very nice A chain gonna pile it up after clearing all that garbage. There's gonna be some pressure and it looks like it was just too much immediately for Cat there. So, Fizzle weren't winning the first match of the uh, tournament for him, four to two. He looked pretty good. Uh, he definitely has some of the most aggressive play style I've ever seen. So, he's gotta be careful. Because that can sometimes lead to a death. But he was on point with his chains. And you know that ended up uh, taking the match for him. So good stuff to fizzle there.